Hello, I'm Catherine. And I'm Jeanette. And we are back to give you the latest and greatest from Suprofo Serum. Now, this is our first video update in 2023, but that doesn't mean that there haven't been new features released since December last year. No, the cloud version releases something new every three weeks or so. So if you want to know the details, look at the product release section in the community. We aim to give you the highlights here in our product roundup. And today, Jeanette, the highlights are... We will show some cool and helpful new AI features in our marketing editor. There's also a new email domain validation released. And we'll talk a little about CRM script triggered dialogues. And we will share uh, how we can use SharePoint documents in mobile CRM. Now, in addition, and perhaps the most exciting news for many, is that the pilot program for our next generation of Superoffice service is open and available. So we'll talk a little bit about that too. Let's get to it. First up, a helping hand to all of us involved in creating email messages. Help is always good to have. Yes, and getting a bit of assistance from AI can be just a ticket to improve or inspire your own ideas. In the mailing editor, you may have noticed the three content boxes with small stars, showing where there's some AI functionality available. Starting with the image, there are millions of free images available in this editor, and finding the right one can be tricky. So this is where the AI assistant can help. All you have to do is describe what you want to showcase with your image, and the AI assistant will create unique and custom images for you. Now, even if you choose not to use any of these, you can use it to get new ideas yourself. Similarly, when you add a new button with your text, the AI assistant will take your text and give you some alternatives. It even has different suggestions depending upon the tone of voice you prefer. I love this. It's often so hard to come up with the right words, and this will he definitely help me, at least, uh, with getting inspiration. Yes, and you still will have to know what works best for you, uh, but it will give you some ideas that you can work with and consider. And the AI Assistant works similarly with generating alternative headlines too. Add your suggestion, and it will return with other options to use as is, or to get inspiration from. Cool. And a bit of help for sure. Now, is this available for everyone? Yes, this is both for online and on-site customers. Now, we have some more news for our customers of SuperOffice Marketing in the cloud because there's a new feature that will improve your email deliverability. Can you tell us a bit more about this, Jeanette? Of course. So when uh, using an external mail server to send emails on your behalf, like what you do when using the online version of SuperOffice, you can improve the chance of your emails being delivered if SuperOffice CRM is on your domain's safe list. And this requires a, a setup where your domain is configured with an SPF record from SuperOffice. And the SPF record is a verification code that you add to your DNS domain settings and it outlines which mail servers are authorized to send emails on your domain's behalf. And new to SuperOffice is that if you haven't set this up yet, you will see a little warning saying that you should validate your email domain. Now you're still able to continue using mailings as before, but we, we recommend to get this validation set up. And there's also a new ability for administrators to control that only approved email domains are allowed for sending emails via SuperOffice. Now this is done in the global preferences in settings and maintenance. And finally, you may also have noticed that the from fields is now split up into two fields, one for the from sender name and the one for the from sender email address. And this allows you to personalize your mailings more easily. Now, this is great. That's small details, perhaps, but yet important and adds to the overall effectiveness of using mailings for marketing purposes. Now, we have published an article to explain this in a bit more detail, along with some tips on how to improve deliverability of your email campaigns. So do check it out. It's available in our community and we've added a link below. The next feature is a lot more exciting than what it sounds like, but the ability to extend CRM script to push a dialogue message to the user within a workflow means that there's a lot more flexibility when it comes to creating customizations, doesn't it? Yes, this is yet another addition to the strong customization features available in SuperOffice. 
But let's start with what scripting is. Serum script is a feature that allows you to automate tasks in or modify the behavior of Superoffice. So it's a programming language that's embedded in Superoffice, but one that doesn't necessarily need developers' expertise. So it's a flexible, but yet at the same time, cost-effective form for customizations of your CRM solution. For example, you can use this to create scripts to automate a set of activities, add or validate data into Superoffice, or opening a dialogue with information to the user. So what's new? Before, when a script triggered a dialogue, we could only provide information to the user and the user could press OK. Now we can create dialogues where you ask the user a question and this will trigger several actions. So in certain scenarios, it can be necessary to ask the user for input or confirmation before completing a process. For example, a script can ask the user if they want something to be automatically updated. And typically, something triggers this flow to start, either before or after you save something in Superoffice. The script can also be triggered by a custom button or a task item someone presses in a menu. But this is actually easier to explain with an example. In this case, we're looking at a sales opportunity that has been won. So let's set the sale to sold. And save. And this is something we want to celebrate. So we ask the user through a script trigger dialog if they want to publish this in the team space. So we prompt the user with a message saying congratulations and if we want to publish this. And then the user interacts and can select yes or no. In this case, we press yes. And then we get a new dialog with a confirmation. And this also says that we are ahead of target. And this is actually based on real sales data that's reported in Superoffice. We had a similar way to do this in the Windows client way back when, but up until now, it's not been available for our web or cloud customers. So it's great to see that this is possible and even for the mobile CRM too. Now, this type of low code, no code customizations are incredibly flexible and it can add value in so many different ways, like ensuring that the key processes are followed through or simply help users to do certain steps with ease. So we really do like things that we can automate like this. Yes, and as you mentioned, we can even trigger the same dialogue messages within the mobile CRM app. So you have the same capabilities when you're on the go. Now, I must mention that we recently held a webinar showcasing a lot of customizations options in Superoffice. So if you want to get some tips and inspiration on how you can drive CRM success through customizations, we've added the link to this webcast below. Now, moving on, we also mentioned that there's something new with the SharePoint integration and our mobile CRM hit up to share. Yes, it's good to know that if you're using SharePoint as your document archive, there's some new features in the mobile CRM app worth noting. So in specific, you can now create your SharePoint documents from mobile CRM. You can also share your Superoffice SharePoint documents as links or attachments uh, in emails. And if you have a tablet, you can also drag and drop files to mobile CRM. And specifically, if you work with requests, we can drag and drop many attachments uh, when working with a message. Or we can drag and drop uh, when we're working with uh, the request screen and a message will automatically be uh, created. We can also drop images and files to Mobile CRM. We can share content and files with uh, Mobile CRM from other apps. And we can also share documents from Mobile CRM with other apps. So this experience is best with the Microsoft 365 apps installed on your mobile phone. Thank you, that's always good to know. Now, last but certainly not least is the upcoming version of Superoffice Service, which has been fully merged with the core CRM. This next generation of Superoffice Service is the result of several years of investing in our technology. And in this process, we took a deep look into how customers actually work with customer requests to identify how we can help even more. This has led to a new version of our current service solution. Yes, that's right. So we are really excited to give a sneak peek with everyone as it offers a new way of working with your requests inside Superoffice. One where you can easier navigate and find the information you need to respond to requests. You will see that you're able to multitask much more effectively and work with the information at hand faster than before. 
All of which customers told us was really important when working with incoming guests. There's so much more to show and explain about this, Jeanette. And this is just a preview to whet your appetite for more information. We'll say that this version will soon be available to new customers of Superoffice. But as an existing customer using service, you'll be migrated in waves, but over a significantly longer period of time. Now, this is to ensure that everyone is ready to take full advantage of what this version has to offer. So rest assured that we will provide you with more information and time to prepare before you get it. Yes, but I would like to mention that if you like what you saw and you would like to get an early start, the pilot program is open for both on-site and online customers of Superoffice service today. So there are some prerequisites to participate, but if you're interested, go to the community and sign up to the pilot program, and then we'll be in touch to discuss your options. Great. Now that's it from this product update. We hope you found it useful and do please feel free to share it with any colleagues you think that can benefit from learning about these new features. Till the next time, have a super day. Bye everyone. Bye.